Thank you for watching Blacksit. Please subscribe to our channel Blacksit. Smash that like button and share everywhere. So, Blacksit family, Blacksit family. Hang on, look who I'm with. Ah! I'm with Soul Fraser. This is you. Um, <laughs> all right, all right, all right. All right. But Blacksit family, if you're new to Blacksit, let me tell you about Blacksit. Blacksit is all about you coming home. We're homecomers, this is Africa. I left the UK for the best place in the world, as far as I'm concerned, and that is my beautiful home of Gambia on the west coast, smiling coast of Africa. And I'm here with yours truly. And if you've never met him before on Blacksit, let me tell you about this man. This man is not just a motivator. He doesn't just talk the talk, but he walks the walk. And he is one of the biggest realtors here in the Gambia. And his name is Sol Fraser. And he is the CEO of none other than Global Properties. And he is a motivating speaker. Indeed, Welcome, indeed. Sol. Thank you, thank, thank you. you. Always a pleasure. I'm delighted to be back again because uh, it's been amazing, you know, um, we're still doing our things and I hope to show you two of our latest projects uh, right here. Yes, I'm excited. Well, we love new <coughs> projects and um, as everybody knows, I'm Nyan Chokajabi. I got renamed because I'm now a Gambian citizen. Yeah, I got automatic citizenship in the village of Busara. Thank you to my Lamin Kajabi uh, family and also to the Al Carlo Fai of Busara. So I just want to thank them because I always got to give thanks for my new identity. Wow, wow. Now this is a monster project. This is big. I didn't notice it was yours. Okay, so he was just saying, um, I'm gonna, uh, Muta Baruch is doing a filming, if anyone's wondering what's going on, why is this? He's slow in catching up <laughs> with us. I'm only joking. Thanks, Muta, for filming today. Right, um, so this is a, a great project, and this is a fine example of partnership and uh, working. Uh, together with partners yes. and you do a lot of that and you do it really well and people coming back are gonna want to do that they might even want to partner with you Absolutely. so what is the process uh, the process honestly it's easy for me the thing is to just to get things going um, it doesn't matter who you are uh, what you what you have and you know what you want to get involved with I make things happen so in this particular project I brought the landowner the developer together and we're here forming a very good synergy and making this amazing development happen. It's called Aquaview, and we have 139 units available here, combination of one bedroom apartments and a two bedroom apartments. So I'll show you the sample house, and then I can show you, sorry, the sample apartment, then I can show you the rest of the development. Yeah, come on, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> sorry. You see, I get the exclusive for you. Get the exclusive. So, say I wanted one. Yes. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm split because I love Kologi, but I love Bigelow too. Yeah. So this area is Bigelow. Yes. Yeah, so this is Bigelow. In case you wonder, this is Bigelow. And it's right next to Coco Ocean. And it's across the road from the Black Sea office, actually. We're just down the road from the Black Sea office, so we're not far. So, yeah, OK, we're going to go into one of the apartments. And then we should do the OK. Oh great, this is the sales office. My love! You see? She, you see how she, she does me up like powder. If I don't call her, you know, she, you know, she don't call me. She don't treat me like her friend no more. My sister. Yeah. How are you? I love your dress anyway. How are you, my sister? Afro Pop is going to go in on. Huh? Lovely. So this is uh, the mock up, is this? Exactly. Oh, lovely. Exactly. So, as you can see, um, we have six different blocks yeah one two three four five six seven seven blocks sorry i have seven blocks which offers you no know, other than underground parking and then you have so guest parking here and mm -hmm. then you have parking under the buildings mm -hmm. there are five floors on each mm -hmm. so on each block there's a penthouse Ooh. <laughs> exactly. I want a discount. Yeah, exactly. I'm starting to negotiate already. Yeah. I'd love a penthouse suite. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you have a penthouse and then you have 
here, which is a terrace on the fifth floor. So you have a roof terrace? Roof terrace on the fifth Oh, come floor. down, come down so you can see the pool. Come, then, come in. Exactly. On the fourth floor, you have the restaurant. You see the pool here? There's a pool. You've got a, a restaurant. Walkway. You've There's got a, a walkway. Clubhouse. Gym. clubhouse yeah, the usual. Gym. You know? Over here, you have Did a you gym. hear that? He, he, uh, here are the sun loungers. He's like these. Yeah. And he, did you hear him? Usual. So for everyone who's not living in Africa, wait, 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 let me just tell you, right? So you've been to the UK, don't even right. play like, right. this is usual. Most of us, a lot of us are living in council apartments. Yeah. <laughs> we can't get parking. There's right. yellow lines outside the roads, <laughs> yeah? And there isn't a pool unless we go to the local swimming baths. Right. And, um, you know, this is an African dream. This is an African concept, but this is almost yeah. also um, just normal living. I'm just going to close this door for a second. Okay. It's also normal living for yeah. many Gambians. It is. And yeah. also many visitors and also many homecomers like myself. Absolutely. See, what, what we are proud of doing is building communities. And you can't have a community with us without certain features. You know, a community must have a communal area like a swimming pool, where the kids can play, sense of security, and have a sense of belonging to whatever is going on here. And that's what we're trying to create. Um, that's why you have uh, a restaurant or a hall there where people can meet and have a nice dinner, the swimming pool that you can make use of, the gym you can meet. And we're gonna have like a, a management company in place, just like we've done in Forest View and other places, and we're gonna take care of everybody that lives in this community. Excellent, excellent. Right, right. So, uh, a quick question <laughs> regarding um, how many apartments? You said there's 139 apartments. 139, that's 140 yeah. apartments, and yes. that's everybody living in really nice, high quality, standard living, mm -hmm. and um, everybody being together in beautiful uh, uh, Africa. Now tell me, what's my view? Because I always say, you know, I, I, I like a past, but what's, what's my view? Tell me about my view here in Vigilum. Come on now. The, the, the amazing thing is that from fourth floor up, you get sea view. I think all the penthouses have sea views, and then the fourth floor has sea views. Some three, sorry, uh, some level three apartments have sea view, but not all of them. So I'll be happy to take you up all the way to the fifth floor, then you can have a look at the amazing view, and then we take it from there. But first, let's look at the sample apartment to see how a ready one is gonna look like. You lead the way. All right. Where others will follow. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> and that includes me. So my ladies, before, before I'm not gonna say, I'm not gonna send a little scene here. Right, I know someone's taking the apartment. I just wanna say, say hi to the Blackset family, my ladies, my beautiful queens. Hello. Hello. Say who you are. Oh. <laughs> I'm Vanessa Williams. <laughs> Where's your accent from, Vanessa? From Gambia. Okay. And Vanessa Williams, is that a typical Gambian name? Um, I'm a Liberian. Uh huh. <laughs> okay. A Liberian girl. You heard that somewhere? Okay. Now, Neil and my queen, what's going on? Hi, Juliet. How are you? I'm wonderful. <laughs> anyway, she's the expert here. She's the project manager. She knows everything about this project. You know, everything I know, I actually learned from her. So. Okay, so there's always, you know, behind yeah. like every powerful man, yeah. there's always, yeah, you know? an educated lady. Exactly. So come on, then, tell us about this project. Yeah. Don't be shy. So yeah. this is an amazing project, and it's really good for investment. To be honest, um, when it comes to the different dynamics within the market at the moment when it comes to housing and investment. This is really the, one of the best projects that we have. Um, and there's a lot of attraction to it and we've sold out on a lot of the units on the fourth and fifth floors already. So it's going pretty well. When it comes for value for money, this is really one of the best projects and convenience factor, all of these things are in place. So you can't go wrong, honestly. So just take a nice tour around. We have an office here on site. Vanessa is here with um, do, at the office, you know, Monday through Fridays, um, you know, working here. So you can visit anytime you want, you know. Um, but definitely this is one of the best projects that we have. And um, just take a look and tour around and then come back and we'll talk some more. But you won't regret it, I promise. So one, 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 one minute. <laughs> so if a, a, a black sit subscriber, Adrian, <laughs> a deep good jobby. So I wanted to um, obtain a, maybe a four or four, fifth level um, apartment here um, or penthouse. 
penthouse. Uh, how would one go about doing that? And, and do you do a deposit or do you, do you want to talk about it? So you can talk about it or you want to leave it to the ladies? Yeah, I'll leave it to the ladies. Okay, we're just going to talk about it. That's what, what I've got you because I know you're going to disappear any moment now. So um, if one was to um, say, right, I, I, I love the concept, love the idea, and in fact, I work across the road and I'd love just to have, sometimes when I'm working late, an apartment I can come and, and stay in. When Blacksit family uh, come to stay, then they will have somewhere that they can also stay in. So um, that's what we're looking at. So maybe some Blacksit family would like to purchase an apartment. Um, you know, can they do it in instalments or is it like you have to pay for everything outright or do you have to put a deposit down? How, how does that work? Because I know you're the brains behind the project. Come on, Agar. So it's very convenient. Um, you can go through a payment plan process or you can pay it outright. We have um, multiple options depending on what your budget looks like. So for us, really, it's a matter of letting us know what your budget looks like and what kind of a payment plan you're looking for so we can actually accommodate that for you. So we can have up to 12 months to 18 month payment plans. You put a deposit of 30% um, down and then the rest you can pay within installments, whether it's quarterly, you know, uh, monthly. It's really up to the, the, um, the customer as far as what they're looking for. Um, but there's a lot of options. You can buy from there. You don't have to physically be here. We can send you a tour, um, video tour of the apartment. If you want to see the specific location and the view you're going to have, we can share all of these details with you. And it's just a matter of coming into an agreement and taking it from there. So it's quite simple, to be honest. Okay, so that sounds, that does sound simple. Now, um, you know, Julie, it's of meager means. <laughs> Could even I afford one? Oh, silence. Yes. He now knows yes. I'm broke. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm joking. I'm yes. joking. I'm, I'm always teasing. Of okay. course. Julia, definitely you can, you can afford to get one. Definitely. The um, starting price is... From... Okay, so the starting price is actually from 49,000 euros. So you can just get a one-bedroom apartment from that price. Really? Um, yes, 49,000 euros only. Okay, yeah. okay. Hang on, hang on. Back to <laughs> this is in the middle of Bidjolo. They said 49,000 euros in the middle of Bidjolo. Next to Coco Ocean. Next to Coco Ocean. This is craziness. Yeah. yeah. Wait, are you sure I'm not hearing wrong? <laughs> <laughs> she said 49,000 euros. Okay. So imagine getting a plush apartment, swimming pool next to the beach, prime location in the Gambia for 49,000 euros. That's a steal. Is. That is a, and then you can pay it in, in part payment for up to how long? 18 months. 18 months. 18 months. So you've got 18 months to rustle the cash, yeah? So why suggest Blacksit families we buy one together? Because I like sharing. Caring is sharing. Yeah, and we can rent it out and get the income back in over a few years. I think that's the best idea. So let's do a profit share and let's buy the apartment because caring is sharing. And that way you can come and you can stay in the apartment free of charge because you're part owner. Let's do this. Let's go and invest and help the best. So let's go and have a look at the apartment and see what it will look like. And um, let's uh, try and buy one. I don't see why not. Come on. Yeah, caring is sharing. Come on, go, let's go and house or something. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. When did you start um, doing this project? Oh, wow. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I do like. Yes. yes. This is... You know I like to test everything, <laughs> so come on. I've got my bag on the table. Uh -huh. I'm already watching TV. Right. Yeah? And I'll open the balcony as well, just give me a few seconds. Oh, wow. This is lovely. This is stylish. And you know what, for, for, uh, for me, for a holiday home, I, I would say like for me, this would be like um, a holiday home, like a beach home, a place where you can come on weekends and relax and live there permanently too. Because if I was a single person, this is like a one bedroom one. This is a two, two bedroom, bedroom one. Yeah. Okay, I don't know because I've not looked around yet. But I'm just saying that if I was to come here, I would comfortably live here. This is really nice. And the decor is lovely. So I want you, Muta, right? to film everything here, because everything here is lovely. 
and um, it has an outside balcony so it's not just about inside living a lot about being here in the Gambia is actually outside living I spent more time outside of my house than I do inside my house I have one of them oil drum barbecues and believe you me I call it jerk pan yeah I use it a lot I cook outside a lot I'm outside a lot I love my plants I love the nature I, I love it I love just being outside so um, let's have a look at the balcony let's have a look at the bedrooms um, I like the way that it's a self-contained unit and for the price I think you know you're getting exactly uh, a good deal I think you're getting exactly a fantastic deal and I, I will buy one of these in a heartbeat does anyone want to um, donate 49,000 uh, or penthouse suite maybe 60,000 I don't know I don't know what the price is but uh, uh, donations that are being accepted for an apartment and of course if you give a large donation you can live here for free <laughs> when you come to stay so uh, I think that would be a good investment you can everybody can do timeshare Absolutely. You can do Absolutely. timeshare? Well, yeah, I, you can co-buy. You can buy with someone else and then put it in the market and then renting out. And this area, to rent it out won't be very difficult, as you know. Yeah. It's a high demand, it's next to a five-star hotel, resort, and it's literally walking distance to Senegambia. It's a prime location. I know rentals in this area mm -hmm. average uh, between, um, I would say, 700, 700 um, uh, pounds a month yes. upwards upwards because I know I have a friend that was living just there I'm not going to say where so um, I know 700 uh, pounds a month upwards so if you look at that over time and calculate it it's a, it's a great stay so now listen this sofa is far too comfortable I don't even want to get up <laughs> I'm going to have to right let's go and have a look on the balcony so I, you know I would put actually put my dining room table out here you know yes. seriously because it's covered, so rainy season when you going to affect it. Yes, it's, it's covered. I mean, as so as this is obviously still being built. So. It's still being built. Yeah. So basically, this is the balcony, and over here you have a playground for the kids, and there's a walkway that goes back to the pool as well. And then, uh, yeah, I'll show you how you can also access access it from the from the bedroom. So I like the windows. So you've got slide-in and French windows, as they call them. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And um, it's got air conditioning as well, because I see the air conditioning unit outside. Yeah. And this is really spacious, and uh, it's got safety glass. In case you're thinking that this is clear, it's not. It's actually safety glass. It is. It's it is. Um, thickened glass, so that is really good for the children as well. So you know, this is quite easily a really nice family home. Let's go and have a look inside. I love the lighting and everything in here. You know, it's very really nice. But even your house is signing. You yeah. still got that house? I do. Someone was looking for a house, you know. Really? <laughs> yeah, well, I told him about your house. Yeah, I'm actually yeah. moving here, so. I, I gave well. them. I gave, that's the number who I told you. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the, that, that's your house. Oh, I didn't know. I thought they were just looking for any house. No, I told them about your house. Okay. That's why I said for you to contact them. Because okay. it's your house. Then no problem. I'll do that. Wow. I, I love the coppers. Yeah. Oh my God. When I was looking for these, I could not find them. Fine. Ask Adrian. All right. Here. Yeah. You ship these in, right? Yes. I knew it. Yeah. Yeah. I was looking for these here and I couldn't find them. Yeah. Wow. I so this love thing, these coppers. this sample, we're actually going to modify a little bit of it. We're going to cut here to put the oven in. Okay. And then we're going to get the fridge to be inbuilt somehow as well. Okay. You know, just to make it more impact and nice. Okay. And then over here you have a, a small outside wash area. Okay. Yeah. So oh, great. You clean it up. So you want to do like your laundry or your local dishes okay. or something. So this would. A, what do we call this again? What's this area called? It's called the, the shack, basically. It goes, mm -hmm. uh, it goes all the way to the underground parking and it goes all, just for ventilation. Okay. Yeah. So that's your utility area. That's what I was after. He's telling me about oh, shaft. Utility. <laughs> <laughs> utility area. Yes, yeah, your yeah. utility area. Yeah. And this is your dining area. Dining area exactly. Yeah. And uh, I like the way you've laid out knives and forks. Were you expecting me for dinner? Yes. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> The last time he had a barbecue, he didn't invite me, so I'm not saying anything, yeah? Oh. He, 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 he blocked me, yeah? He blocked me, but I'm not saying nothing, uh, not on camera. Yeah, yeah. I'm only joking. We'll, we'll fix it. Okay. So this is one of the bedrooms. Okay, this is nice. Yes. 
This is nice. Yes. Everything yeah. self-contained, so you don't have to worry about space. Yes. So you have the balcony, small balcony as well. So you have a balcony here I'll as well? Balcony, yes. Oh, that's amazing. So you have a balcony out yeah. here as well. Right. And then it can fit in a bed, a nice bed. I yeah. like this bed. Yeah. Yeah. And some cushions. And uh, you know me. Yeah. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Yeah, it's a good bed. It's a good bed. I like the bed. And the wardrobes are nice. So does it come furnished or can you have the option to furnish? Because I like the furnishings. The furnishings are lovely. Yes. If and they're very spacious, actually. These are it bigger is. than my wardrobe. It, is. it comes without the furnishing, but if you want us to furnish it for you... We'll you got the option. It. You got the option, okay. exactly. Yeah. Lovely. And this is the bathroom. Oh, I like this. Yes. I have one, but it's not as nice as this one. Yeah. Oh, everything's working. Right, let me get the light on. Hey, where's it gone? This is a switch. I like these covers, you know. Yeah. Oh, very nice. And you've got all the things inside. Yes. Nice. And then you have a coat hanger here. Yeah. And this is uh, the door. So it doesn't um, impede anything. So you've got enough space. And then you have an open shower. Yes. And yes, I do love open showers. I even put them in my bedroom after bringing to visit your your place. I put, put one in my house. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, all the other three bedrooms have got open showers. And your mine's got the enclosure up to walk off. That is nice. I really like the styling. I like the stylizing and I like the colour scheme, in fact. And this one has an ensuite. Yes, it's a bedroom number so this two. This is master bedroom. Exactly. This is an ensuite. So this is, is a bigger room. And it also has a balcony. A balcony as well. Yeah. Nice. Listen, this is good. This is value for money. Yes. I have to say this is value for money, Black Sip family. Oh my gosh. Listen, I'm not here to sell you anything, by the way. I'm just sharing information with you because some people have asked me. They don't want to build a house, you know. They don't want to go and buy a whole big compound. They just want somewhere they can live where other people are going to be based. So I'm showing you community living here in the Gambia. This is called community living, uh, high quality community living. They want something that would resemble the kind of lifestyle that they were used to in the US. So now, and in the UK, so now I'm showing you um, the kind of standards that you can have here in Africa. Because some people are under the misconception still um, about the quality and standards uh, that you can have in Africa. So I'm going to show you the ensuite. So this is a nice ensuite. And there's also a shower. You've got a shower unit with your shower curtain here. And uh, your towel, your fixtures, your fittings, your bathroom, your lovely cabinet storage unit. And the light is on. Oh, very nice and your cupboards, and you've got a really nice kitchen wall, and you also have the muslin wash, yeah? So, um, it's, it's really nice, um, really nice apartment, I like it a lot, and um, yeah. To me, I wouldn't even mind buying ground, I wouldn't even have to go up, you know what I mean? Right. Yeah, but um, I'll still take one on the third or fourth floor. I don't like stairs, is there lifts or is it stairs? Oh, yeah, yeah. There's, There's a lift. lift. Each block has a lift that goes all Oh, no, listen, I've changed my mind, <laughs> I've changed my mind. <laughs> no, I'll take a third or full floor. I'll take a full floor and uh, it has lifts, yeah. That suits me just fine because <laughs> I want a sea view, obviously. Mm -hmm. But even on the ground floor, you've got the children's park, you've got everything, and you've got lovely facilities. And I like the fridge as well, even though I'm a, you're going to have this fitted in. It's still a lovely fridge. So, um, listen, I hope I've maybe dispelled some myths about what it's like to buy a, a new apartment here. Um, also to show you, the, I want to show you some of the constructions and show you how they're built too because, you know, um, this is important that I show you the construction uh, so you can see exactly uh, what you're buying into, yeah, and you're buying into a fantastic building. I've actually been on site uh, with one of Seoul's other projects before um, with his other partners and uh, saw great construction going on. So let's go and have a look. Okay.
one nation, one Africa. Thank you, Blackset family. Please keep watching and remember, follow your dreams. Purchase your tracks today. Purchase your tracks today.